Hey guys, I thought I'd do a video on uh, on my Morgane five band dipole. This is a fan dipole, and um, I've always been told you spread out the the legs on it, the uh, the outer edges of the fan dipole. But I found this one at a ham fest, so I thought I would I would pick it up. Uh, it was thirty dollars from an old guy who's got Alzheimer's and no longer in the hobby I felt bad for him but um, anyway the uh, the dipole is really really cool I, I wanted to show you guys this they're no longer in business I'm trying to focus in here yeah they're no longer in business so don't pay any attention to the phone number and I'm trying to get this thing to focus sorry I'm using my phone here but I'm gonna scroll down slowly so you can see this stuff And then I'm going to show you the an actual antenna. My cat sitting on my keyboard. Here's where you need to. What you need to know about the lengths. But see how it's got these little taps in there. I had to remove the 20 meter one. I don't know why. I I might put it back on. I didn't move them a little bit I don't know why they don't sell this anymore this is like a great design I have a ballon on mine, current ballon. Let me see here, here's the, the SWR on it. I thought about changing those bands too, because I, I mean, I have a tri band, so I really don't need 10, 15, but you know, maybe I could get it uh, for, I don't know, 12 meters, 17 meters. I think this was sold as uh, I don't I don't know if this guy made this thing from scratch. Let me go outside and actually show you the antenna now. And this is why yeah, I had it center point up on that branch. Oh my gosh, look at this guy right there. Anyway, uh, I had the center point on that tree there, and the the rope broke. So I got it down right now. We got a hurricane coming, so just as well be. You can see it. So these things broke. I tried to like glue them, but you could just use glue sticks to, as your separators. You know, looks like the waves on the flag. You know. Kind of green here from all the oxidation but this is the part so on 40 meters uh i'm sorry on 80 meters it's a fan dip i mean a folded dipole so it'll kind of go out here and then go to the end and all the way back so hey okay, look they're all at the central point right Just fold it back, right? Okay, so there's my 10 meters ends. 15. 20 meters, right? Ends right there. And then I get three that go out. The middle one, I think it is the middle one, ends out there that's 40 meters and then the 80 meter is the one folds back I don't know if you can see that let me see if I can zoom in see so the middle one there is is the end of 40 meters 
half-wave dipole, and then see how it folds around. Fold the dipole for 80. So let me see, just guessing. Uh, this is probably 10, 20, maybe 35 feet, 30 feet on each side. So it's not all that long. Oops. Give you an idea. So I'm just going to leave it down like this until after the storm passes. And then I'll, uh, I might have to put another piece in there. And so, see how this insulator broke? I tried to fix it. And I just took the whole glue stick. You just heat the wire up and then you just push the stick in there. <laughs> that's, that's all you need to do. So I anyway, fan dipole, I've got a um, MFJ current hoop on there. And uh, my last one got whacked by lightning. This one might not be an MFJ, it might be a different brand. But I had a lightning hit, blew this thing apart. I think I showed you that on one of my other videos. And then this coax. I only use this on the lower band, so I don't care. This is the uh, 8X. There's my lightning arrestor, and I got a lightning rod there. That's grounded in with the tower and everything else. So there you have it, folks. This is a Morgane five-band dipole, and uh, I highly recommend you uh, look up the schematic for this and consider making one yourself. It's really not a big deal. Unless this is solid copper, I, I don't like using the stranded copper when I make antennas. Hard drawn solid copper wire would be good. I'd try to get the tin stuff though. Um, not the copper, we'll just get copper, we'll get a tinned antenna wire if they still sell it. And uh, I think it'd be great. It works really good. When you get it up a nice and high, it works really good, especially at 40 meters. Um, but it's nice to have, uh, even with the tri bander, you know, you still like to have another antenna. All right, later. Have a good day.